the figure shows a hemispherical ball the water is flowing into the ball at a constant rate of 180 centimeter cube per second when the height of the water is h the volume of the water v is given by this formula where h is 0 to 30 find the rate of change of the height of the water in centimeter per second when h is 10 now for such questions we have three things here number one is this second is this and third is find the rate of change of the height now first talk about this one the water is flowing at 180 centimeter cube per second now centimeter cube is a volume and per second is a is a time so actually this thing is dv over dt now another thing is find the rate of change of the height in centimeter per second centimeter per second centimeter is a height and second is a time so it's a dh rate of changes dh over dt so this we have to find this thing is given another thing is v is equal to 1 over 3 if i open it by h square 90 minus 1 over 3 by h square h so v is equal to 1 over 3 this cancel so that is this is cancelled by 30 so that is 30 by h square minus 1 over 3 pi h cube we have dv over dt now we have to find so now this is v and this is h so we can get dv over dh so this is a relation between v and h so that is equal to 30 times 60 pi h minus 1 over 3 times 3 cancels it is 1 over 3 pi and h cube is 3 h square 3 and 3 cancel so that is pi h is a common so it is 60 minus h so this is dv over dh so now we have dv over dt dh over dt we have to find and we have dv over dh so we have to find this we have to find this one dh over dt so dh over dt is equal to i'm writing it same dh over dt now the only thing we are having is a volume so i can write dh over dv and dv over dt so you can see how easy it is to make the equation so that is equal to we have dv over dh and here it is dh over dv so it is 1 over pi h 60 minus h and dv over dt is 180 multiply 180 and if h is equal to 15 so we have 
dh over dt is equal to 1 over pi h is 15 60 minus 15 multiply 180 so dh over dt is equal to Point zero eight four eight. So zero point zero eight five. This is two scientific figures. So that is the answer. And that is centimeter. Don't forget to write the unit. That is centimeter per second.